Okay, that was so fast. You guys always ask me about this brush. That one has seen its day, so I ordered this one off of Amazon, and I'm gonna try it out. If I were to compare the two brushes, this one is, is this smaller? Yeah, this one is a little bit smaller, but I think it's gonna do the trick. Definitely feels better because half of the pegs aren't broken, like the other one. How do I have any hair left on my head? Okay, so first I'm gonna get my bangs dry. When I blow dry my bangs, I have to consider my cowlicks. I will lift up in this area here, like lift and elevate. But in this area here, I've gotta be careful because it's already naturally lifted. So I have to pull it down tight and then I'm gonna direct it this way. And this one, I'm gonna direct it this way. You'll see. So lifting up here. And then this side, it wants to curl in this way. So I have to go the opposite direction. All right, so you can see I have a nice lift here by doing that and it's directed to each side of my face. Now I'm gonna to switch to this brush. So I'm gonna pull and lift up. So what I'm doing is basically what it would be if I hung my head upside down. I have a little bit more control over it this way. So I'm lifting this up at the root and blow drying it from underneath and that's gonna give a lot of lift. The reason I love a brush like this is because it dries my hair so quickly. I know this may sound basic, but some people may not know. So I'll put my brush in like this. I kind of go backwards and then frontwards and grab it. It gives me a lot of tension. Back, forward, pull. This took me maximum 13 minutes. I did stop and start a couple of times. So this works wonderful. It's very inexpensive. I'm gonna leave a link in my bio for you and I hope this helps and I will see you later. Bye.